Hello there, my friends. Welcome to the Star Wars Vault. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe for new Star Wars content every week. Hey guys, in today's video I want to point out some rumors surrounding the future Star Wars Disney Plus series titled Acolyte and what it entails. Acolyte is a series that was announced at the end of 2020 that apparently will focus on the emergence of dark side powers in the final days of the High Republic era. There's no official release date for the show. It's anticipated that we won't see it until at least late 2023, if not 2024. The two main articles that I gathered information regarding these rumors were from Bespin Bulletin and Inverse.com. I must say guys, some of these details are crazy and exciting for what we may possibly see in this show. According to the articles, there are reports of concept art showing a planet with large snow-covered mountains alongside tall cities which have long tentacle-like features and bell-shaped roofs. There is a very similar designed planet in the Clone Wars show called Scipio, to which some believe are one in the same. Now this is a really big deal because Scipio just happens to be the homeworld of the Mune species, the same species Darth Plagueis is confirmed to be. Let's not forget this Acolyte series is most likely to be set around a century or so before the Phantom Menace. So as you can see this could possibly be a huge debut for a, you know, a very legendary character who has become a known commodity even to casual Star Wars fans. It's important for me to state that Plagueis is by no means confirmed to appear in this series, but if there is any truth to these leaked rumors about Scipio, it's almost guaranteed that we would see the ancient Sith Lord in this Acolyte show. Because there is so much vagueness nowadays when it comes to Plagueis' life in canon, it gives Lucasfilm flexibility to make this character a powerful feature for this future project. Especially, especially since he is a moon, not a human, his life expectation on average as a species lasts over a hundred years. Maybe the dots are starting to connect in front of us, and if you think that maybe a hundred plus years is not long enough for it to make sense for Darth Plagueis to be in the Acolyte, let me remind you that the dark side of the Force is a pathway to many abilities some consider to be unnatural. I think it would be incredible if we were to witness the live-action debut of Darth Plagueis in the Acolyte series. There's so much you can really explore if this becomes a reality. I mean, we're talking about Palpatine's master here. It would easily raise the potential viewership of this show immediately. We could see him exploring dark side powers, which is the attraction of this show in general already. I'm very hopeful and excited to see how this will all look when we see the first trailer for this show. But I want to see what you all think about these rumors. Do you believe it's possible this Acolyte series will feature Darth Plagueis? If so, what would you want to see revolving around him and the Sith as a whole? Whatever your opinions may be, make sure you drop a comment below. Also, if you appreciate the content, don't forget to force push the like button to support the channel. My social media is linked in the description. And with that, my friends, I'll see you in the next one. And until then, may the Force be with you.